Imagine, one gram of this stuff can destroy a city. A teaspoon of it would release more energy than an atom bomb. It's not some movie gadget, it's real, and it's antimatter. Physicists have actually created antimatter, small particles that are mirror copies of everything we find. There is an evil twin to every particle in your body. The electron, the proton, the neutron, the positron, the antiproton, the antineutron. The universe created the same amount of matter and antimatter early on during the Big Bang. But here's the universe puzzle. They would have totally destroyed one another. But somehow, we are alive. Why something and not nothing? That's one of the largest enigmas in the entire science of physics. Scientists entrap antimatter using magnetic fields in places like CERN, because if antimatter meets matter, boom, total destruction. Clean energy, according to Einstein's famous formula, E equals mc squared. If we could store antimatter safely, one gram would fuel a Mars trip and back. NASA has even investigated the possibility of antimatter propulsion. Sounds like science fiction, I know, but it is all too real and frighteningly powerful. The catch? Antimatter costs an absurd amount. It would take more than a trillion dollars to make one gram and centuries at current technology. But with each atom of antimatter that we find, we're one step closer to unlocking the most fundamental mysteries of the universe and perhaps, just perhaps, discovering why we're here at all. Antimatter's not merely a scientific wonder, it's an opening on the doors of creation itself. The history of antimatter is the history of us. The deadliest substance in the universe could be its greatest enigma.